Hi guys, I'm Naka Chan and welcome to my reaction for Fairy Tale episode 92. Well, I guess uh, maybe uh, this episode we got finally a full Erza Erza fight. Maybe the fight between King and Dragon Slayers will be finished. Or Mystican's plan will be shown. I guess we'll see. <laughs> but. Yeah, previous episode not bad and visually very beautiful for real. Ah, this arc is getting reaching towards its end. Well, I don't know what the next arc is, but I would kind of feel I would be missing at a loss, even though like the kingdom is not the best and then king sucks. But Mr. Gen is a prince. So that might get interesting. So I probably should just start. <laughs> because I want to know what will be happening. So. Yeah. Yeah, you did. Come on, Happy. That's not really nice of you. That wasn't really nice. Lucy is cool. If she wouldn't barge in with Coco, what would happen to you? Ah, come on, come on, come on. Okay, a little bit back. <laughs> oh yeah, they felt. And they barely held them down. That's not very nice of you, Happy. Maybe he is tired. Yeah, they're fighting. Oh, these people are still around. Yeah, soldiers. They will still be attacking you. So you need to fight them off. The music got them. Those who are alive. <laughs> Okay, someone died or what? Aw, uh, she just doesn't want anyone to fight. What a nice girl. But I guess we don't have a choice here. I mean, look at what is happening. Okay. I hope his eyes wall helped. Yeah, they need to turn next season to Lacrima. That's not very nice, right? Gray has a point. Freezing them over, or at least hurting them now a little. Thank you, Gray. Thank you. Okay, we are here, finally. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not surprised. So he was giving them the information. Thank you, Adolos Lucy. Well, of course, if we fight together. But there is other fairy tale fighting. Damn, they don't really trust their powers. Wow. Wow. Oh, it is a spite. It does look dangerous. There's a Erza. Oh my god. Wow. That's impressive. Jesus. Oh, what now? Ooh. What is that? Cool. They're just throwing attacks at each other. <laughs> One Elsa is changing her armor and weapons, other Elsa is just having her changing weapon. Got them. I mean Elsa is a great fighter. 
No. That's kind of weak. No. What about fight with other fairy tale? Pray. Ah, oh, this Lucy must feel like I don't like what are you saying, people. Yeah, tell them, Lucy. Tell them. Yeah, they won't stop, especially the king. Yeah, the king is crazy. He won't stop until he... Until he get what he wants, and then he would want more. Jesus Christ, fairy tale, at the last one, come on. Damn, it looks even more scary than before. Yeah, it's been hurting. Okay. Ah. Uh, so it sucks that small amount of magic they have. Huh. Okay, that's a resolve. That's true. I mean, what do you expect from crazy? But we feel that you are completely wrong. Yeah, we can just stay there and watch. Oh my god, these people. You are weak. Weak-minded. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Wimps. Running away all the time won't help you. That'll get you. One time, sometime. Hmm. Yeah, they don't have much magic. Okay, we are getting to our Lucy Ertlin. Oh, Loki! I should be calling him Leon, but I will call him Loki. Because I like that name more. Oh, Happy's helping Charles. <laughs> All these characters. Okay, she's using that web. Oh my god! Charles! <laughs> oh my god, it was nice of her, but it's dangerous. Yeah, I mean, look where Charles went. She really thought Happy is annoying, and now she willingly jumped in front of him to save him. Yeah. yeah. Jesus, there is too much of the people. Yeah, Grey, maybe make a wall of ice so they wouldn't be shooting all around us. We need Wendy, she can heal her. And there are these monsters. There is so many people around them. Come on people, don't be such a wimps. Like I've said, if you will be just running, it won't help you. Yeah, and this is not even their world. It should be you fighting. They have nothing to do with this world and they're fighting because they 
well, nothing to do. They have something to do because um, they kind of some part of their world got kidnapped. Jesus, there is too many of them. But like, it should be Adela's fairy tale fighting. Yeah. Yeah, it should be you fighting. Come on, Lucy, I believe in you. I mean, I believe in both Lucys. Damn, she... She fights. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, it's not easy to fight so many at once. Especially when everyone is just shooting around and there are these monsters around. Like fighting one on one or two people, not that hard, but so many, not easy. And I don't think someone here has like magic which be used on a huge area. Well, Great Kana was doing that, but still there is too many of them. Okay. Jesus, finally. Finally someone. These flying monsters are huge. Yeah, finally fairy fairy tale is here. The other last one. Took you long enough, guys. With such numbers we can fight them off. Well, I hope so, because you were kind of disappointing me a bit. Kinda. 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 But, I mean, better late than never. <laughs> better late than never. At least. Good work at the Lazarus scene. What the hell is Lizana holding? What the hell is that? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I mean, they can use weapons, so they're using weapons. Oh my god, Loki is like, double Lucy, I can't help. I, I can't do that. <laughs> oh my god, that is interesting technique. You must be so confused. What the hell are you talking about? Guys, don't fight. Okay. They're a great duo. Yeah. Show that you can fight. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh wow, that's interesting. Okay, they can put the fight there, we're just kind of wimps. Yeah, confusion. <laughs> confusion. We need healer. Yeah, this fairy tale needs to take things in their hands. Because now, if they went here, in future, if things, bad things will be happening, they might fight. I hope. And continuing with... Wow, that was cool. That's a moose. Erzan. And some destructive power. Oh my God. Girls, why are you doing this to me? Why do you look so hot? Well, oh, okay, okay. You still haven't experienced all the armors as I have. It looks so cool.
Well, um, okay then, we'll see, I guess. Damn. Okay. Fairy armor. <laughs> okay. Damn, girls. Yeah, that, that's some destructive power. Uh, that's a lot of destructive power. <laughs> Got them, girls. Yeah, they are kind of even. But Elsa can still put another armor on. Yeah, you completely destroyed it. Okay, that's some resolution. Resolve. Damn. Fist fight? Erza fist fight? Wow. Brawling, Erza. That's thing I never thought I will see. Oh, we will. Okay. We'll fight you and stop you. Yeah. You're twisty. I mean, what else you can do? Thank you, Wendy. Hmm. But this thing is kinda sturdy. Can you just shut up? Right? Find your own magic, bastard. What is happening? What the hell is that? This dude! This dude! Where did you hit your hat? What happened to you? <gasps> yeah, find your own. Stop stealing shit. Taking what's not yours. <laughs> she doesn't like this gray. Don't mind the other one, I guess. Maybe. Oh, she fights with. Okay. Hmm. Probably. I mean, that's what usually happens with wars. This is such a weird sight to see. I mean, you can beat the shit out of them. Don't, no need to kill them. Maybe he wished to be? Come on, Loki. <laughs> I can't imagine. <laughs> that didn't go well, <laughs> Loki. She cool. I mean, look at them. They're also trying hard, putting on fight, trying to help. Now they're tired. It's so probably different for Charles, because usually Charles felt like she's protecting Wendy. Not other, wi other way around. <laughs> Wendy protected me? That's a completely new feeling. Jesus Christ. Yeah, how many sacrifices are you willing to do? She is right, our Erza. Well, they can also do the other. You know, violence cause violence. Okay, I like it. Clash of Idols. Yeah, this Erza Earthland one must be so pissed at her other self. I hate it. How can you say these things? You're completely wrong. Hmm.
Well, maybe you can live without magic. Yeah, maybe you don't need it. Nice talk on our jutsu, Herza. <laughs> I like it. She, she she's spitting facts. What can you do about that? I mean, yeah, she should understand. Because Adela's Elsa can have like kindness in her, and our Adela Elsa definitely can have something evil in her. You know, it's always like this, yin and yang. They were just misguided because they believe that what they are doing is right. Most of these people, they believe they can live without magic and they need to do that. Nicely spoken, Earthland Erza. It was truth. I mean, yeah, you, you can't fight facts or truth. That's so nice of her. I mean, some people love to fight truth, but like, um, I have no words about stupid. Okay. Hmm. Okay, um, maybe call, uh, calm down. Into reverse. Oh. He's like, well, you wanted so much magic. Well, haha, I'm gonna get rid of it. Haha, <laughs> okay, that's radical, but maybe it will think, make things better. I don't know. Okay. Is something happening? Okay, whatever. Okay, I'm going to give this episode seven and a half out of a ten, and I like it. Yeah, the fight between like Erza between Erza at the end, like I I can't say anything else than just Earthland Erza was right. She was spitting facts and truth, and like gladly Adela's Erza realized that. I guess, yeah, most of these people in the kingdom were just misguided. And they believed what they're doing is the right thing to do. Though they were probably hurting a lot of people, so they have a lot of things to do to repent that. To, like, make things better. I hope they will do that. And actually, Mr. Gens, or Adela's Jalal's plan, is interesting because here... There is little magic, so people are kind of fighting over it to have at least some. So if there wouldn't be any kind of magic, there wouldn't be a thing to fight for or over. That's actually kind of clever. Maybe it might be too radical, like Lily said. But yeah, it might work. I guess we'll see about that. Might It might work if he gets rid of all of the magic. Yeah, people would need to think uh, differently, how to live without it completely. Yeah, they wouldn't probably have a time to fight over stupid things, I hope. And um, that would be nice punishment for the king. Ooh, ouch. Ouchie. Because all the things he did for gaining magic and then... <laughs> This job would be like, nope, you got none of it. Never ever. <laughs> yeah, that would be nice punishment. That's kind of a little bit sadistic. <laughs> Even though King deserve it, but like, yeah. You wanted all the magic? I'll give you none. <laughs> I'll give you none. Ever. <laughs> Jesus Christ.
I, I kind of like that, yeah. That would be cool. I hope that would really happen. And, like... There weren't that much. Uh, Lucy, Grey, Charles, Happy, fighting. There were too many, like, uh, soldiers, so it was kind of hard for them. But at least Adela's fairy tale appeared and saved them. Yeah, I'm glad they finally decided to fight. Like, Adela, as Lucy said, there were kind of whims. I understand this was really hard for them. And Makarov, Adela's Makarov got killed or... I don't know if, like, in this world it was Makarov who was, like, their master. But I can understand that after that happened, like, the strongest person in their guild gets killed. You definitely lose a little bit of hope. And will to fight so you think how to like survive and I get it I, I get it but like maybe like especially if magic is scarce you, you can't just run forever you know because one day it might happen the army and soldiers and kings would get you and all of you will be wiped so at least maybe put a fight <laughs> try to do something Right? You might at least try to fight. Especially now when like Earthland fairy tale appeared and they're fighting. So you might as well help them because together you will be able to achieve better things. Like you will definitely win. It would be easier to fight the army, the kingdom. Yeah, like they probably didn't thought about it much. But I'm glad uh, Adela's Lucy told them. They definitely needed that. Like, yeah, Adela's Lucy is very... Um, She has that leadership perk. <laughs> she can do that. She, I guess, acts kind of like Earthland Erza. People listen to her. And she gives them nice speeches. And hope. Like our Erza, Earthland Erza. Even though she is a little bit harsh. Yeah, they're very similar. <laughs> yeah, this is pretty nice arc. I do really like it. Like, there are uh, some character developments. For example, with Charles and Happy. Even Wendy. Like, she is strong. She is like Dragon Slayer. You know, she uses Dragon Slayer magic. But, like, previously she wasn't fighting because she, I guess, wasn't that sure about her skills. But here she was. Because, like, Natsu and others gave her, helped her to believe in herself. Yeah, I'm glad. That's, like, a nice development of characters. It's, like, not that on your face much it happens. But there definitely is some kind of development. And I do really like it. I feel like the biggest development so far got a uh, Lucy got one, Wendy got, and Happy Charles got. Like all the things which happened definitely changed them. At least here, but I am like seeing them right now, and I do really like it. Like Lucy is changing more and more. She is like fighters right now. Like she could fight before. But now she's like really willing to fight and really going in. And I love that. Same with Wendy. And her supportive magic is very needed, which is really cool. And Happy, like, he wasn't a fighter before at all. But like here, he was helping Charles. He was putting a little bit of fight. He got some resolve, even though he was scared, he was trying to help. Like, yeah, great for them. I hope, like, everything will be okay after this. This arc was very important for characters, because it helped them to kind of gain some inner strength or believe in themselves. So that's really cool. Yeah. I really like that. I like what am I seeing here, the trend. <laughs> really, really cool. And I guess that's all. Yeah. Goodbye and see you next time.